I'm Mitch with Home Hacks for the Daily Dose. This is Crate Art. Do you have a blank wall in your home? A wall that could benefit from some love, some texture and dimension? Well, today we're gonna to put crates on a wall and fill them with decor. Crates are a great way to work in any style. They're different textures, materials, colors, and sizes. So grab whatever crates draw you. To begin, we're gonna work with a crate configuration that keeps the eye moving around a room. It's not a focal point, it's more of a piece of art. So I'm gonna grab these pine crates. If you put three crates of the same size next to each other and space them consistently, that's a simple way to create a gallery-like effect in your house. The eye moves with the line. If you wanna get a little bit more creative, mix in different kinds of crates together. And do this on the floor of your house before you put them up on the wall. It's much easier to play on the floor before you have screws and screwdrivers involved. So when you're mixing different kinds of crates, I recommend that you keep consistent spacing between the crates. That's a way to bring some order when you have so much chaos happening with this intentional random effect. So you can see I have about two and a half inches between each of these crates. And either have that two and a half inches or intentionally depart. So this is an example of five crates that could go up on a wall and have that mixed effect. Now for today's installation, I'm gonna pull out the wood. In this living room, we already have a few natural elements and I wanna inject some metal. So I'm gonna grab the two metal crates, stack one on top of the other, and put them next to a crate that has a piece of art in it. Now this piece of art is a rigid photograph and it's been mounted with twine. I love twine, it's natural, it's cheap. You can get real creative with twine. All right, so we're gonna install this up on the wall and then I'll show you how to fill the bins. So this is the installed look. I love filling crates with objects because there are only so many objects that'll even fit in a crate. So play around with what you have and see what you like. I like that owl. I don't know why, but I do. We have one more touch and it's this succulent. Ta-da! Only one network brings it all home. The Design Network, home revealed.